April 26th. That's Josh Grossenbacher over there. Walt Gabbert. We're in Hillbilly Man. We're in Kentucky. It's been raining all morning, so we've just been standing out here in the misting rain. And as soon as it stops, we got a turkey gobbles up the mountain here. So we're retreating to the truck to gather our equipment. And uh, y'all want to go chase him, I guess? Yeah. That's what we're here for? I got my crap on the other side. It was like straight up in there, but that might be. But is that coming around the hill? I don't know if that's another turkey. It's right there. Yeah, that one ain't that far. All right, so I can't remember how well we detailed the situation, but hunting with Walt here in Kentucky. He's got Josh in town, and we're hunting some public ground this morning. Last year I came down here, Walt whistled me right into his prime stuff. He said, not again. We want to earn this one, so right here on the public ground, and we're currently listening to a turkey because it's quit raining, and as soon as it quit raining, he started gathering. So this must be tall boots. They about reached their max right there. <laughs> Kill him if we just get right there. Cause he's, God, he's right. He feels it. Then we can. Our deer trail's kind of. We can go up there and hook on that. I think that's the bench right there.
I guess it's him and some Jake's up there. <coughs> Definitely sounds like one right here. Yeah, I don't know about these ones down at the bottom. But... When you yelped at him, he needed to take about three more steps to be in that, see that lane I got straight yeah. up through there. He stopped right in that line, line of crap. The only reason I, I tried to stop him, he was moving so fast through yeah. there. And then when he stopped, he, you couldn't see him, could you? No, he was, was right, he was right in that line of crap. I need him to take about three more steps. It was right at the end of that deadfall. He went right up, straight up and over. Oh. And I watched him. I could see him go right just a little bit. Yeah. And then I lost him over the top. 100%. Well, we've just been killing time, really. I'm trying to let those turkeys settle down a little bit. All the gobbling stopped. The sun was supposed to get out here about 8.30 or 9. But that's what time it is now. And it still looks like we're a long way from getting some sunshine. So we're going to climb to the top and do some calling. See if we can strike one up. There was a few in here, so. show that being a rock in the face. For sure not. So come on on X, do a little better. Your topo lines. Your topo need to be more detailed, need to be more need to be better. Well we've taken our gap into rocks. See the gap? There's the gap. 
But the reason we didn't take the gap before is that's the reason he's right here like a buck 50, buck 75. We don't think we can make a move on him from here. We needed to go down and come around like this. But we can't get over when we get down there because these objects seem to be impeding our progress. So we're going to either have to just get risky and go in front of this rock and hope that there's a fold in the lay of the land or something to where he can't see us, but it just sounds to us like there's nothing between us but air, so it doesn't seem like that's the issue. But that, or we're going to drop all the way off the mountain and come up the bottom. That would take a lot of doing to do that, so uh, we got a decision to make. Thank you. 
this day. I mean, he was right over the edge from us. have been fired. <sighs> Boy, that took a lot. The turkey was right in this bowl right here behind this rock. Got to right there, you can see, I don't know if you can see Josh. And I ended up crawling back, getting behind this rock, going all the way down. Making a big old loop, getting on a downhill side, just yelping and scratching and raising cane, and he gobbled 14 million times. What happened? Missed. <laughs> Dang it. You ever seen him? <laughs> Stubborn rascal, wouldn't he? Yeah, but man, the whole time. Like once I slipped up to here, I finally found him and he was about a hundred yards away and he was just in the same spot. We found he was him. on like a little point and he was just pow, pow, you know, he was facing us the whole damn time, strutting and gobbling yeah. in the same spot. And then finally you started getting aggressive down there. Yeah. And it was like, man, he craned his neck up real high and he's watching. And then here he come down the hill. Really? And then, yeah, you know, like, see that big dead log? Yeah. He come around the hill and I could see his head up through there. The last place I saw him, well, it was up there, but he come down through here and was tight under the damn bank the whole time. Uh, I was wondering because he got quiet. Yeah, you were, I was, the whole time, I mean, he wasn't yeah. 25 yards here. And finally, I just, I couldn't take shit no more. <laughs> I just, I just eased up. And about that time, I was like, oh, oh he saw you. Yeah. Just Did he fly off unscathed? Oh, I didn't touch his ass. Really? <laughs> yeah, he was... <sighs> Dang it. Where was he standing when he shot? Somewhere right in here? He was right down on that side of that log, but when I went to shoot him, he was on this side of it. When he... Smelled a booger. Peeling out, yeah. <laughs> it's a long... Uh, duel. Long a long duel. Yeah, Lord. Waiting on a gunshot forever. Me it too. Okay. I honestly thought as soon as I dropped back, I thought I wouldn't probably even make it to you That's good. That's what I thought. I thought I probably wouldn't even make it to you good, and he would he would give it. Cause I told you what I went by. I said we need 30 yards. Mm -hmm. I said if he gives us 30 yards, he's toast. Because I mean, as soon as we called him from there, we heard yeah, he came I could hear right to the top. Where I was. Yeah. The last place I saw him up here was behind that big log, and he dropped down and come underneath that rock, and I couldn't see him from where I was at the whole time. And from got to right here, and he was he was walking straight at me, and I could have shot him, and I thought, well. I'm just gonna let him walk right down in here. I'm gonna yeah. pound him at 15 yards. Yeah, yeah. Well, then he stayed there for. That's when he got quiet, and, he, and you just stayed there. And I'm like, oh, oh I can't, man, I can't you can't take, take it. I gotta look. <laughs> hey, we appreciate you guys joining us for this video. If you like this one, you'll probably like the next one. I'll leave it up here in the corner. Don't forget to subscribe and follow along with us. We'll leave our social media links down at the description below. That's also where you'll be able to find links on the turkey calls we use and the apparel we wear and that kind of stuff so you can find that in that little drop down description below and uh, as always we sure appreciate you guys following along